Robots have quickly become the norm in kitchens all over the world, with the technology becoming cheaper and finding workers becoming harder. Fast food giants like Chipotle, Wingzone and White Castle are all heavily investing in kitchen robotics. One of the most fascinating startups in the kitchen robot space is Stella Pizza. Founded by former SpaceX engineers, they have created a touchless machine that fits in the back of a truck and creates a pizza in exactly 45 seconds. By the end of 2022, they plan to roll this out, starting with the Los Angeles area. The business model is completely breaking the mold of traditional pizza restaurants. Stella Pizza plans to serve pizza from trucks and the pies themselves are put together not by humans but by robotics every 45 seconds. Benson Tsai, who founded Stella Pizza in 2019 along with fellow SpaceX engineers Brian Langone and James Wahawisan, got about two dozen former SpaceX employees to build a touchless pizza making machine that fits in the back of a truck. It must be said that Stella isn't the first company to conceive of robot-made pizza, and the early startups in this space has ended in a lot of failure, including the notable failure of Zoom Pizza, which was once valued at $4 billion. It shuttered its robot pizza delivery business in January 2020, and has since pivoted to making compostable packaging. Another pizza robot concept is Piestro, an ambitious startup that plans to have 3,600 machines deployed in the next five years. Their unique selling point is using a robotic pizza machine at bricks and mortar and ghost kitchen locations that will lower the cost of a normal restaurant model. The trend has moved far beyond pizza as well, with Miso Robotics, the maker of the Flippy 2, a robot arm that works the fryer at fast food restaurants, already deployed at Chipotle, White Castle and Wingzone. It's being introduced to the Middle East market as well through a partnership with Americana, a franchisor and franchisee with over 2,000 restaurants in the region, including KFC, Hardee's and Pizza Hut. Robot chefs are becoming commonplace. Jake Brewer, Miso Robotics Chief Strategy Officer said, Such machinery will soon be commonplace in restaurants. I believe that if anyone wanted to, they could go see a robot working in a restaurant in 2024-2025, Brewer said. You can go see robots cooking right now, and that's only going to grow week over week. Chipotle Mexican Grill worked with Miso Robotics to customize the Chippy robot which cooks and seasons Chipotle's chips with salt and fresh lime juice. The robot is trained to recreate the exact recipe using artificial intelligence. As of March, Chipotle was testing the robot at its innovation hub in Irvine, California, the Chipotle Cultivate Center. The company plans to use it in a restaurant in Southern California later this year and will determine if they will roll it out to all its stores. Another reason is the ease at which robots can recreate standardized recipes. In fast food restaurants, most recipes are highly standardized, making it easier for robots to recreate the same product every time. If you are interested in the future of the food industry, check out our free trend reports on some of the most cutting-edge trends in the food sector. Link in bio. Another reason for the rapid growth of kitchen robots is the inability for restaurants to find staff. The National Restaurant Association reported last year that four in five operators are understaffed and overall employment in the leisure and hospitality category that includes restaurant staffing has been the most challenged since the pandemic according to the data from the Bureau of Labor Statistics. Similarly, a recent report from Lightspeed found that 50% of restaurant owners plan to install automation technology within the next two or three years. For Stella founder Tsai, the robotics are a means to an end, making sure that the company can deliver an affordable pizza pie that customers like. While pricing has not been finalized, he said the target price is definitely sub $10.
A 12-inch pie of cheese pizza will run about $7, Tsai said. The plan for Stella, which has raised $9 million in funding, includes national expansion.